Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. And a very good day to all panels and viewers. My name is Momen Rikmal bin Azmi from School of Mechanical Engineering, UITM Shalam. And today, I'm going to present about my final year project 1, which is the analysis of 3D printing filament using polyvinyl alcohol PVA. Before I before I start, I would like to express my gratitude to my supervisor, Professor Madia Technologist Dr. Norfazli Adunmanan, for the guidance throughout the process to prepare this proposal. In this video, I will explain about the background of study, the problem statement, objective of study, the scope, and limitation of study, literature review, methodology, expected result, and also the project planning. In the background of study, the polyvinyl alcohol or PVA, which is also known as PVOH or PVAI, is one of the synthetic polymer materials. This material is the same category of nylon, polystyrene, polyvinyl chloride, and others. PVA is a material that are soluble in water, and at the same time, it is non-toxic materials and good resistant to grease, oils, and also solvent. This material was discovered by Dr. Fritz Klade in 1912 in Germany. Besides, PV also can be used in the industry of food packaging, medicine, and 3D printing. In industry of 3D printing, the material able to improve the quality of any complex design and use for support structure for any design. For the problem statement, after we have finished print the model, usually, we need to remove any unwanted part attached on the model or we can say the support. After remove the support, a lot of unwanted chip are produced. Furthermore, the unwanted chip is not easy to remove if the model printed is complex and needs some support to make sure the model print is the same as the design. Besides, during the process to remove the unwanted chip, people may accidentally did some damage to the model during the removing process. So, the objective of study for my project is to study the effect of model after being put in water as the filament is soluble in water to observe the quality of product after removing the support. And then the next one is to observe the difference of time by removing the adhesive chip from the model support by manually operated and water dissolved. In scope and limitation of study, I'm going to clarify that I'm print. I'm going to print two type of sample, where the first sample is going to print using polylactic acid (PLA) filament, and then the second one, the PLA, will be print together with the PVA, where the PVA will be used as a support for to support the model structure. So the first one is focused on the observation when the model is print with or without the polyvinyl alcohol PVA filament as a support in terms of quality to observe the quality of the model after print and then the second one is focused on the time taken to remove the unwanted chip at the model uh, where to find or observe uh, which one is the best and which is much faster uh, to remove the unwanted chip. For the literature review, this is some of the article that I'm using for my proposal and research study. The first one is from Taswa Kitagami and his team, where they did some research on the PVA to apply circuit method to load the curcumin in PVA in tablet form, where the curcumin is a substance that they are using in a medical application. Then, next is from Andrea Gabriela Christian and teams, where they did some publication on the PPA in medical application to make sure that the user able or easy to use the medicine. Then Mr. Kumaki and teams did some experiment to ensure that the PVA is suitable to apply as a model support structure in 3D printing application. Last but not least, Mr. Balin Basa and teams did some research on evaluation of biodegradable of PVA where the result shows that the PVA may reduce the environmental impact and able to make the waste become zero. Alright, so in methodology, 
The first one is I did some identification of complex 3D design, 3D model design, which is to ensure that the model uh, that I will I'm going to use in fabrication have the element of complexity. Next one is for the selection of model. I decide to choose this gyro model to be used as my sample. Second, the third one is for model creation. I did the design or I create the design in Tinkercad uh, after sketch the design and insert all the parameters in the Tinkercad. Alright, so next for the process of printing the model using 3D printing machine. Okay, as I mentioned before, I'm going to use two types of sample, which is the sample one, the, where the sample will be, will be used only PLA filament, and then the second sample, second sample will be used PLA and also PVA, where the PVA will be used as a support. So at first, the sample one and two will be using the machine of Ultimaker Extended 3, as it can print both sample as it used to extrusion but do some problem on the second extrusion so only sample one able to print as it only used polyurethane acid which is PLA filament so I'm going to decide to use creality and the tree so at the end uh, I'm only able to print only sample one all right so last but not least after finish the printing process, I did some observation on the model. As we mentioned before, that only sample one is able to be print. The data of observation have been taken. So on the left side is the condition of the model of PLA before removing process where there has the support on the gyro. So on the right side is the condition after removing the process. So for the expected result, after finish the printing process, so I need to did some removing process to remove the support structure on the gyro. So during the process, the time to remove the parts or the support is about 20 minutes uh, for a small scale model. So it take a long time and I think if we use the BVA, the time should be much faster than only print the model using PLA. So after finish the uh, removing process, so I did some observation on the quality of the product where the result is not so good and there's some damage at some of the part due to its difficulty to remove the outer part. Alright, so this is the project planning for this semester only. Okay, for the briefing of FYP1, okay, if I'm not mistaken, uh, I'm start at week 2 until week 7 because on week 1, uh, I, I still have my internship session and I am start the briefing of FYP at week 2. Uh, the lecture was given by Dr. Zaino. And the next one is for the title selection, where uh, during week one until week three, I did approach a few lecturers uh, for them to be my supervisor. And on week three, I did uh, able to get uh, approval from Professor Madia Technologies Dr. Norfazia Dumanan as my supervisor, and he accept my title for this final year project so and then the next one for search for articles I start it on week number four until week number ten okay the next one is design the complex model so as I'm, I have been mentioned before I did some identification first and then select the model and then design the model in the ticket so this is the process during the week number five until week number ten so next one is the, the literature review where I start write the literature review after 
able to find a few article and then write it on my proposal and then after finish all, all of this uh, starting from week number three I revised with with my supervisor for an update to him to ensure that all my points uh, is good and then second one I did prepare my FYP slide for the review for the video presentation on week number 11 until week 13 and then lastly submit the proposal is I should submit it on week 12 but to some problem I submit the proposal and all the files logo and video presentation on week 13 so that's all for me Thank you. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.